Hello, blessed people. Let's talk about this video that we trained this is yesterday. Let me off. Let me reduce this. Uh, let me reduce this television. Let's talk about this video that we trending. This woman and the husband, the three children. They came from they just came from Italy, yes, yesterday. And uh, so he has this trend yesterday. I don't know when when it happened. So they came from Italy on their way out of airports with immigration and all that. The woman literally picked a husband, maybe probably the passport of the time. She took the passport and threw it on the floor. I don't know. And the immigration officer that was there, they were questioning her, why did you take your husband's passport? She did not take her home. She did not take her children home, but he brought her husband home and tore it and threw it at the floor. So the husband was calm. He didn't even say anything. So I saw the video on Instagram and I just scrolled probably and just complained. I just said, ah, could it be that, that the woman is the one financing everything? Maybe it's a, it's a woman, is dominant woman. There are some women that sponsor their husband everything. I think because it's, I just over, and I look, overlooked. So later, I started trending on Twitter, trending on Facebook, and now the immigration officer, the, the immigration officer, they have dropped a, a memo or a letter that they are going to investigate into what happened because, because of the way he was trending. So my take, I want to drop my take, worry what I feel because I saw it on Facebook and I, and I commented that men, they should, be they should take care of, they should be mindful of the kind of woman they married. There are some women that you know, even when you are, you are still dating, you know that these kind of people, they are asked that if they have money, if, if money, if money recognize them, they will maltreat you. You know them. You know that kind of woman, you right from the one, right from the offset. So I would just say that this woman is a woman that when you have money, when you have money more than a husband, if she's the pom pom type, she's one that will be proud and she will be beat. She'll be the one that dominates and all that. We have such women like that. That's so women that they are power drunk, that they are money drunk, money influence them. Why so even when they have the money, the husband doesn't have they, they mellow down, they are very calm. So on my take, the woman later, the woman, the woman later came out to say everything that happened that even when they were in Italy, the man used to uh, maltreat her, he used to give her attitude. I don't know if the woman, if the man is a womanizer, I don't know, but she, she didn't mention that there are people that has wife, husband that like that they will understand. The woman give her own because people be bashing the woman and all that. So and the, the husband, I also saw a video that I clip where the man also came out. I also explained his own part. But on my take, the woman is very. If the woman is to be blamed, yes, she's doing blamed. If you look at her face, you look at the woman's face because when she was giving her own narrative, it was then that her face was captured. If you look at her face, you look at that she had that wicked facial expression in her face. These are the kind of if that woman, that woman should be from Edo State, she'd be from Bini. Because Italy people with Bini that they want going to Italy, she'd be from Bini, Edo State. I tag her like that. There are some women that are so wicked. I'm telling you, especially, especially if they are the, the breadwinner of the house, if they're the one carrying the family, carrying the children, paying every expenses, everything in the house, they will maltreat I have one. They will maltreat the man to none. I'm telling you, that woman, what she did is wrong. And the authority, thank God that the what the immigration authority have written, they should investigate her very well and arrest her. Or if they want to give her punishment, collect her own, deny her of tribe back again. I don't know whatever reason she has. She doesn't maybe she doesn't want the man to go on their behalf. They just came for maybe probably for um a for long short a long break. But the Italy, I think the children have about four months break. They gave them four months break. Maybe they came, maybe he was thinking that the man would go back with her team and with her the children. That's why Italy was so wicked. You can seize it, you can't do anything, other other thing, not tearing it. It's even to Nigeria, it's even a, like a damn play to Nigeria. Yes, why would you tear your international passports? Not that you got smith, not, not, not that you got burnt, you saw it. The woman should also pay the heavily for it. I think the, the authority should not take it lightly. Whatever reason you have, I've listened to our, our, our explanation. Whatever reason you have is zero. You have hot temper. Women should also control their te uh, control, control their emotions. Your, your anger is just too much. Yes, your anger, if you can do this publicly, it's only God that knows what you are doing to that man in, inside. No, it's only God that knows. That woman have anger issue. She should work on her anger. Anger can if anger can do anything. She can raise one thing, raise anything dangerous, and hit the man one day. These are the set of women that only buy their husband when he's sleeping because the husband is womanizing. They have side chick. We have had a countless of stories like that now. That you carry a pistol, you carry a knife. While the husband is sleeping, you go and hit them. This is the kind of woman that will do that. You are very heartless. Your facial, your facial expression also bring you that. You, you, that there is no smile in you. Because of that anger in you, that bitterness in you, make this your face ridicule. Require me.
make it rico. It's not good. Women, if you have that kind of heart, because you are the breadwinner of the family, it's, it's, an, it's an avenue for you to start matching anybody around you, even your husband. Do you know what your husband is? Even your husband, whatever. I know men are supposed to provide for the family, but if it's not in that shoe, and God make you to be in that shoe, do it in a, in a, wonder, in a, in a good way. So that God will be blessing you. And I would, what if it's on, if yours is on, on that road or way around? That is the husband that did to you. That husband took your passport and, and tore it. How would you feel? So women, please, I'm talking to my gender. We should control our emotions. In or out, either in the house or outside, we should control our emotions. And our, if you have anybody that have anger, you should, should go for prayers. If you have anger, you should go for prayer because it will do you a great deal. It will do you a dangerous deal, I'm telling you. Anger, before you lift up something and hit your child, even enjoy yourself, you won't know. Anger, if you have anger, control it. It's not something you should throw it. Don't play with it. It's very dangerous. Anger is very dangerous. Play, don't play with it. May God deliver that woman. And I, the authorities should take it. You should not take it lightly with this woman. They should sue her. Anything, anything you want to do to her, let her re, replace that. Uh, 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 this. Look at people are making jest of it now. Look at this man. Now. Look at the picture of this man now. She just he puts his own. He's sleeping. You know, he's not hiding his own. People are making, they are not making character sure of what is happening. Because I don't just know what kind of the, whatever issue you the husband have over there, you can resolve it. No, you tearing in a public place. You think you could not get home first. You tear it in a public place. That is the extent of that bitterness and that anger in you. May God deliver you.